I'm just gonna pop the ability to predict his goblins. Maybe. Oh, nice. <laughs> and that should be tower down right there. Yo, what's up guys? In today's video, I'm gonna be playing the best Little Prince deck in Clash Royale. If you guys enjoy the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. The Little Prince is probably the best card in the entire game right now. I think it's even better than any evolved card. It's really good and to be honest, I have to give some credit here. It's really fun to play with as well. I've been having a ton of fun playing with the Little Prince. I'm just gonna go for it at the bridge here because I see that this guy's playing with log bait. I just like, I'm really happy with what they did with the Little Prince. I feel like it's a really good card, but like it's good without the ability and the ability makes it pretty strong in itself as well. But what I like the most about it is that you can't just randomly use the ability every single time. You have to be really smart when you use the ability because if you mess it up, you're not going to get anything at all and you just wasted three elixir. I feel like it's the most, like, the highest skill but highest rewarding champion. I'll just go for it again at the bridge here. He doesn't really have anything good for this. I'm just going to pop the ability to predict his goblins. Maybe. Oh, nice. <laughs> and that should be tower down right there, right? Okay, he just goes for the knight, but that's going to be nearly tower down. <laughs> that's what I mean. I played three elixir there just to get that big guy and the goblin's dead. This champion is so much fun. You can make really, really cool plays like that. You can do these really, really fun and cool defenses with it. It's just like a really unique card. And I feel like we've never seen something like it before in Clash Royale. And I'm really happy that they added it into the game. I feel like maybe it does need a bit of balance changes. Like maybe nerf the ability a bit because the card on its own is pretty good. But I wouldn't say it's like nerf worthy without the ability there. But otherwise, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think about the Little Prince and the Evolved Archers as well. Onto the Evil Archers. I feel like the Evil Archers aren't actually as great as everyone was thinking. I feel like the Evolved Knight and the Evolved Royal Recruits are much better than it. I feel like Evolved Knight and Little Prince are is going to be like the new meta. I feel like um, Evolved Archers don't really work with the Little Prince too well. I feel like it does, but it doesn't. I feel like it works with Knight better is what I mean. It definitely does work with the Archers, but in a deck like this, and just in many other decks, you just kind of would prefer the Knight over the Archers in the first place because they kind of have the same role, but when, when you combine them, they're still very, very good anyways. I'm just going to go for the poison on the tower here. I just need to get two poisons on the tower. All wall breakers at the bridge and predict his princess with my knight. <laughs> I'll miner here right where the barrels landed at so I can just save my log for the next barrel in case I need it. I'll just poison the tower again and that should be good game. So I'll see you guys in the next match. I'm in the next match here against Lupin. And another thing I wanted to add is... What do you guys think you'll be using for the new 21 challenge? If you guys don't know, the 21 challenge has been announced on the Clash Royale page Twitter. Basically, um, if you don't know what the 21 challenge is, it's just like a challenge that goes up to 20 wins. To complete it, you have to win 20 games with only two losses. If you take three losses, then you're out. It's like a regular challenge, but you have to win 20 games, and it's always filled with like everybody in the entire game. It's like a really nice event that they hold pretty much every single year. And depending on how well you do, you get like a badge on your profile if you get 17 plus wins. And otherwise, you get like some like chests, some golds, like just nice stuff like that. It's a very fun challenge. And let me know what you guys will be using. I feel like the decks that people will be using will be changing based off of like the new edition of the Evil Archers and the Little Prince. A nice thing to note about the challenge, though, is that you'll be able to use any single card that you want. It's going to be like a challenge, like a grand challenge or a classic challenge every card will be available to play with every single evolution so that's gonna be very very nice i'm kind of destroying this guy right now <laughs> i'm just gonna go for my okay i'm just gonna go for my log there on the right i could little prince but i just want to save it okay i'm gonna go for my knight here try to catch that miner okay unfortunately i don't catch the miner but it's not the end of the world i don't really mind when i don't catch the miner as long as i'm not like in a terrible position. I'll go for the minor wall breakers here. He's probably gonna have to prince. Yeah, he does go for the prince there. I can just defend that with my okay, I'll just go for my bomb tower and then skellies. I can go for my little prince as well. Little prince should do a really good job, but I think I'll go for the Evo Knight instead, and then maybe I could counter push with this because I want the bomb tower to keep splashing on that prince because the giant wasn't really the threat the prince was, and that pretty much took care of my entire Evo Knight, and that thing has a million health, so I think it was better to put that. I'm gonna go for my miner here. I'm gonna pre-log for his goblins as well <laughs> it's too easy i'll go for my little prince in the back here i think 
I get a little bit scared when playing against the Little Prince. It's a little bit awkward to defend because it hasn't been out in the game for too long yet that I'm not like amazing at defending it, but I will tell you guys that Poison does kill it, so Poison's really important right now. Also, a Royal Delivery plus a Log kills it, so it's not like uncounterable, but it's like always going to get a positive trade. I'll go for the Wall Breakers here. Very nice ability there on the right side as well to take care of his Little Prince. I'll Poison on those bats, and then... I can just pull everything back. There's only 21 seconds left. I'll go for the Miner on defense. Very nice Miner right there. I'll go for my Knight. Then I could just uh, go for the Log on these Goblins. And very nice win there. Oh, wait. N oh, never be too careful against that card. I'm just going to block it in its tracks. I'll go for the Skellies here. Yeah, that's exactly why you have to be super careful with that card. All defensive Miner and GG's. I will see you guys in the next match. I'm in the next game here against Sakura Emiris. Just going to split my Wall Breakers in the back. I feel like I butchered that guy's name, but it's not the end of the world for me, I guess. He might not be too happy about it, though. I'll go for my knight in the back for that Lumberjack. Hopefully it's not, like, Lumberloon Freeze or something like that. I feel like Lumberjack only leads to decks that don't really take any skill. <laughs> I can play my Little Prince in the back here for his knight. Okay, he goes for his, so I'll just poison on it here. I feel like I just really like to poison this card. I feel like I never want to mess around with it, but... It is a negative trade, so it's not like always good to do that. I'll pop the ability here to kill the bar barrel and just keep this alive. Just make him have to defend it. Yeah, I forced out the E-Drag, which is great. And the Lumberjack. Yeah, just the ability right there. Forced out 9 Elixir. I'll just go for the Log here. I'm going to take like 1 or 2 hits. Yeah, 1 hit right there. It's not the end of the world, though. I can just go for my Knight on defense. I don't want to activate the King Tower because I feel like I'll take way too much damage. And... It's going to be Golem E-Drag for sure, so... Eh, maybe not, but I think it is. Just going to go for my Miner, then split my Wall Breakers here. It should be kind of annoying for him to defend these. He might just try to get a King Tower activation. Okay, never mind, he just pumps. I'll poison it here. He's going to be up a few Elixir, so... He's probably going to Golem in the back. I can just go for my Skeletons here, though. I do have my Evo Knight and Little Prince in Cycle, so defense shouldn't really be too much of a problem. If he Golems, though... I feel like maybe he could get me with, like, Skeleton Dragons if he has them. I can just set up my Evolve Knight in the back here. I don't want to play my Little Prince until, like, he supports it with, like, an Air Card or something like that. Because that's really my only way to kill his Electro Dragon. So I have to be very careful when I'm playing against it. Yeah. Okay. I'll just try to snipe it down there with my Little Prince. The only way to, like, like do anything would be to Tornado on it. I'll just put it low because all of his cards are way far back. I can go for my Poison now. He's going to Tornado it for sure. Yeah. But his, his Little Prince is going to die. That E-Drag is going to take a ton of damage. Oh, <laughs> he does go for the ability across the bridge. I'll go for my Defensive Miner up top. Bad Lumberjack by him. I can just go for my Low Knight here. And Knight should counter everything pretty nicely. Oh, I have to Skeletons too. I messed that up a bit. But my Knight got knocked back, which is great. I'll just go for my Split Wall Breakers in the back. And I'll go for my, for my Little Prince behind the Knight. And then I can Miner on top of the Pump. I'll go for my Knight at the bridge again. Because he may overcommit to defend it. And if he doesn't, his Pump is dead. I'm going to pop the ability here and the Skeletons to keep my Little Prince alive. I'm going to Wall Breakers here on the left. I need to keep pressuring. Okay, nice. Wait, that Evolved Knight is getting destroyed. Look at that. <laughs> Little Prince is so good. I'm going to Miner here to tank for it. Nice. He has to defend it again. Yep, he had to waste the Lumberjack. How much Elixir did he have to defend on that, by the way? That was insane. I'm going to keep pressuring on both lanes, though. I'm going to Wall Breakers here on the left, and then I can go for my Little Prince to snipe the E-Drag. And then I'm, I can go for my Miner here again. This guy's getting pressured so hard. Okay, I'm going to pop the ability here to knock back that Knight and maybe, like, finish off the E-Drag because it might turn around. Oh, nice! It did! It did! Wait, I'm going to log to kill that Lumberjack? Perfect. Okay, this is looking really good for me. I'll just Skellies here, and then I can Wall Breakers again on the left side. I'm going to knight the bridge because he might ignore them and golem in the back. Okay, perfect. I'm going to minor and little prince at the bridge. This is a little bit uh, scary though, so I'm going to pop the ability. Just try to pressure him super hard so he doesn't really have anything. A wall breaker is here as well. Nice. Wait, I'm getting some good damage actually. Maybe those wall breakers could connect. Maybe, maybe. Okay, nice. It forced out the tornado and that little prince is dead. That was very good. Now I can just defend with my bomb tower. And whatever he supports it with, if he supports it at all, I can just snipe it with a new uh, little prince. He, he, he goes for the E-Drag. That was bad. All defensive minor and then poison. I could get my my Little Prince down. All skeletons up top as well to pull everything. I don't want the E-Drag to hit my Little Prince. I'll go for the Knight here up top. And then I could maybe Wall Breakers kite that Knight. Actually, I'll pop the ability instead. The ability should do me pretty good. Yeah, he pops his. I'll just go for my Log here. Make sure to take care of everything. Mine died, but I don't really care. I wanted to get to a new one anyways. I'll just defensive minor here on top of it. Oh, no. Dude, that card has more range than it looks. That card got range on it. I'm going to poison here on the E-Drag. Just because one more poison will kill it. But I don't think he's going to support it anyways. 
I'm going to Little Prince in the back. Since he has no EJ, I don't really have to worry about him killing it with anything. I'll, I'll set up the Bomb Tower and then Skelly's to block that. I can Evo Knight on defense. This Evo Knight's going to do good. I'll Minor Wall Breakers to pressure while defending. And then I'll Poison on the Little Prince. Wait, I can pop the ability here and I can maybe knock back his. Oh, yo, look at that ability. I'm going to Bomb Tower here. That was a crazy ability. <laughs> that ability was nasty. Okay, I'll just Log Poison here. And that should be GG. Log Poison takes care of the tower. Very nice win there. That little prince at the end got so much damage. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next match. I'm against Muri here. Just going to go for my miner in the safe spot here. Try to figure out what this guy's playing. Okay, he has the Evolved Archers. Evolved Archers are good on defense, but the reason I think they're not that good is just they're just not, like, that great on offense unless you allow them to be. Like, you have to feel like, feel like you have to do something wrong for the evolved archers to get value but with the evo knight and the evo recruits they just get value no matter what unless you do something wrong with them okay i'm just gonna go for my high little prince here it will snipe the tombstone and then it will snipe the bowler if he doesn't do like a tornado or something so hopefully he doesn't have a tornado but that little prince is gonna go crazy oh that's gonna kill the e giant i'll go wall breakers oh he has the tornado so i'll go for my bomb tower here bomb tower will clean everything up pretty nicely even the bowler oh bad bar barrel wait he, it was bad because he put the E-Giant as... I mean, he put the NATO as soon as he could. He should be super low. And he has no bar, bro. I'm going to Minor Knight, Skellies, and Wall Breakers. How does he defend this? Oh, that little prince is going to get so much value, actually. Nice, nice. Okay, he pops the ability there. Maybe my knight could get one more hit. Oh, it didn't. But I can go for my little prince here. And it will get a ton of value. Okay. I'll go for my skeletons here to pull everything back. And the his little prince is going to have to walk forward to come to mine. But mine's already going to be, like, completely killing his... I can go for my Evo Knight the bridge here. He's going to bowler, but then I could maybe pop the ability to knock the bowler like away and be really annoying. I'm going to pop it like this. Oh, nice. Yo, and the bowler turned around. Now my little prince is going to kill it. Nice. And the Evo Knight's going in. Wait, that should just be tower down. I'm going to poison here. Yeah, that's definitely tower down. There's nothing he can do. He says good game. Yeah. <laughs> Very nice win right there. That guy just got destroyed. The little prince is amazing. I'll see you guys in the next match. I'm in the next match here against Mostema. Just going to go for my split wall breakers in the back. I'll go for my high Evo Knight up top for the goblins as well. Okay, nice. He has the Phoenix too. Phoenix and goblins and zap. Okay. Um, I don't really know what this is. Not many decks really run zap anymore. I'll go for my little prince to counter that Phoenix though. Little prince is a really good Phoenix counter. It's just good against air cards in general because it doesn't move anywhere. So it starts shooting a ton and super fast. I'll go for the poison on his little prince right there. I guess I could have guessed it. he had that. He has the Fisherman as well. It's probably going to be RG. I'll pop the ability here. Okay, that ability is tanking for it. Hopefully, it could kill the Fisherman at least. Yeah, 3 for 3. Not really the worst trade, I guess. Oh, and he had the Goblins. I guess it was 3 for 5, but I'm going to log, so it's 5 for 5. Eh, a Wall Breakers to Kite. And he goes in the back, so he has to defend those Wall Breakers too. Probably with the Zap. I'll go for my Knight in the corner here. Yeah, he does Zap on the Wall Breakers, so I did get po a positive trade out of that. And all skellies here on top of the ghost as well. To keep my knight a bit healthy, I kind of want to go for my little prince here. Ooh, bad phoenix. Very bad phoenix. But looking pretty good for me right now. He goes for the fisherman. I'll go for my miner on top of it. It's kind of weird, but the miner will kill it. And then he has to defend my little prince completely. I'll pop the ability. Maybe try to predict his goblins. Oh, never mind. Damn. Well, the ability's already down. I can't do anything about it. Wait, maybe Matt can kill his though? Nice. Perfect. Okay, I'm going to wall breakers here. I'm going to pre-log for his goblins. Nice, he has to zap now. That's really good for me. I'm going to go for my Evo Knight here, and then if I just Little Prince to bridge behind it, how does he defend? Little Prince to bridge should just like... Okay, I'm just going to Little Prince here. Dude, oh my god. <laughs> Dude, I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. That would have been good game right there. If I just go Little Prince and pop the ability, it's good game. Aw, man. Okay, I'm just going to go for my Defensive Miner here, and then Poison. That mistake is not awful. Okay, I'm going to have to Skeletons here as well to block that. Oh, he popped the ability. I'm going to go for mine, and then I'll Wall Breakers to retarget. Hopefully, I don't take too much damage. Okay, it's on the Little Prince now. I can go for my Knight the Bridge again. I think I will to keep my Little Prince alive. I don't want it to die to those Goblins before it starts shooting quickly. Oh, he Archied that back. That was a huge mistake. I'll Miner with this. He Fireballs on defense. I'll just go for my Bomb Tower here for the RG. Pro like, maybe force out the early Fireball if he has one. I don't think he has lightning with the zap. I'll just go for my knight here to kite this. And then I can little prince on the RG. Little prince is so good against RG. I don't even need to pop the ability though. I'll just poison on everything. 
I'll go for the wall breakers as well to block for it. I'll go skeletons, evil knight, and then I can just set up another bomb tower here. I shouldn't really take any damage. I'm going to get a pretty good counter push here as well. Could just go for the minor wall breakers with this. Yeah, I'm going to minor wall breakers here. Maybe I'll get a connection. He has to goblins. Okay, yeah. If he zaps, maybe I'll still get two. Only one, but I'm fine with that. I can just go for my knight skellies here. He has no zap and cycle. I can go for the bomb tower as well. I'm going to little prince for the RG as well. This is going to be a really good counter push with the little prince. <laughs> little prince is so good on counter push. I don't even need to log. I'll just log just to cycle. I could go for my miner. Okay, nice. Good thing that I waited, I guess. I'll pop the ability here. Oh, bad ghost. Nice. Wait, that's going to keep the little prince alive. I think I'm just going to chill out here. He has to defend that miner. I can defend his little prince. I don't want to choke right now. I'm in a really good spot. I'll knight here for it. He popped the ability. I'll go for my skeletons here just to pull up the phoenix. Wasn't really the greatest ability by him. I'm just going to go for my wall breakers. Okay, I'm going to miner. I'm going to poison. If he doesn't catch it, I only need one more miner and poison. Okay, nice. He didn't even try to he didn't even try to catch it. All skellies here. I'll go for the little prince on the RG. Little prince is so good against RG. I'll pop the ability here, I'll log, and then poison will take out the tower. Yeah, he gave up. GG's. I'm gonna minor poison. Very nice win there. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. <laughs>